Hi, myself Dr. Jaya Prakashati. I am a professor and distant implantologist currently practicing at Chandrayat. The clinic name is Asanamba Dental Care. And currently I am working as a professor and head of the department of prosthodontics and implantology. Bone grafting generally we will advise in case of restoring the tooth with a missing, restoring the loss of the tooth with implants or in case of a, uh, in order to eradicate the edentulism with the help of dentures. Whereas in the in case of a uh, lot of restoral resorptions when there is a no bone to support a uh, underlying structures we have to restore with the by doing the bone graft either autograft or allograft. After doing the bone graft, the side effects of the bone graft is very very minimal or very very less. But depending upon the patient's habits like alcoholism, like uh, tobacco chewing and condition of the bone, age of the patient and sex of the patient, if there is an hormonal changes, if there is a deficiency conditions and if there is any kind of systemic diseases like uh, uh, diabetes mellitus, if there is a very more prone to the restoral resorptions, there might be a patient may complain of a very slight pain and swelling and irritation. If there is a um, chronic inflammation, the patient may complain of a swelling over the surface of that, uh, over the area of the bone grafted area. But bone grafted area is a one which is going to restore the loss of the bone structure in order to support a two structure as well as an implant. So bone grafting either it may be autograft or allograft, it doesn't have any kind of side effects unless the patient doesn't maintain a very very proper horizon and unless he cannot follow the proper instructions by the dentist. Whereas in case of lifespan of that bone graft again depending upon the age of the patient, sex of the patient, bone condition of the patient, any degenerative diseases, any systemic diseases. So, and also the forces, applications of the forces are a crucial load to that area where we have done the bone graft to the missing tooth area. It matters a lot. So, if the patient maintaining the oral hygiene status very well, if the patients following the instructions given by the dentist, there is a lifespan of the grafting is very, very good and also the patients will be much more satisfactory and condition of the bone graft is much more satisfactory and the patient is very very happy.